How to add a portfolio to your Shopify website. Now this video is going to be a complete step-by-step -step tutorial. I'm going to show you everything that you need to know step-by-step -step in order to add a portfolio to your Shopify website. Okay, so by the way, this will work with any theme. So just go ahead and open up the editor so that we can go ahead and start making changes to your website. As soon as you have done that, what you then want to do is go to the first link in the description of this video. Go ahead and click on that. And that is going to take you over to this website called Elfsight. Now, Elfsight is one of the best tools that I've came across online. Now, Elfsight is a software that allows you to add different widgets. Basically, it, adds you to, it allows you to add a bunch of different add-ons to Shopify without the need to code or anything crazy like that. Um, and it's the best website that I've found to do this. Another awesome thing about this is that you can get started for free. So all you need to do is enter your email in right here, click on start, and then you can go through and basically sign up to Elfsight. Once you have signed up, what you then want to do is go to the widget section right here. And this is going to show you all of the widgets that you can use with Elfsight. And there's a lot of these here. So feel free to play around with these after. However, we are specifically looking for a portfolio. So just go ahead and type in portfolio and then you can see this right here. So we can go ahead and click on this. And then it takes us through to this section where we can like edit the widget and we can select a template. So from all of these templates, you can go ahead and choose one of these. Um, some of them are more specifically tailored to other ones. So this one is, you can use it for anything, but it looks best as really like a hairstylist. So just go ahead and choose the one that suits your company the best. Um, I'm just going to go for this one right here because it's very simple. And then all we need to do is click continue. From here, you can then go ahead and add in like a bunch of different pictures. You can edit these pictures out. You can add in names. Uh, so if I go here and type in like blonde wavy, you can see that if I now find this, we click on it, it says blonde wavy, and then if we like hover over it as well, uh, we can do this for all of these. So, uh, brown hair, <laughs> I don't know what this hairstyle is called. Um, yeah, so you, you can basically do all of that. You can like swap them around, go in, you can edit the pictures, you can add new pictures, you can like link to the website, you can add a description. Basically, this entire thing can be customized. Um, and yeah, once you have done all of that and you have edited these pictures and basically this looks how you want it to look, what you would then do is click on add to website right here. It's then going to save the widget and basically give you a preview of how this is going to look. Once you are happy with this, once again, click on publish in this top right corner. And then from here, it's then going to ask you to pick a plan. The plan that you would pick depends on how many monthly website views that you get. So as you can see, we have like 150,000. So just go ahead and choose one of these. However, if you're new to Shopify or if you just want to test this out, you can go for the free plan right here, which is what I'm going to do. Now, as soon as you've picked the plan, it's going to take you through to this screen right here where it gives you a piece of code. Super simple. All we need to do here is literally copy and paste. So all we need to do is copy this string of code, go over to Shopify right here, and then make sure that you're not in the header or footer bit, make sure you're in template. And then all we need to do is add section from all of these areas that open up, all of these options, sorry, click on custom liquid. And then right here in the liquid code, we literally just paste in what we copied and boom. This will then be added in. And that is how you can add a portfolio to your Shopify website. 